Good evening. This is a rideshare driver, Lance Jones. Well, actually, I changed my, changed my name. Uh, this is uh, Lance Jones dri- driving. Uh, I still got to figure a new, new name out, but anyway. This is Lance Jones driving in Las Vegas and more. And um, I wanted to talk about what happened to me last night. I had a ride, was supposed to a ride at, at the Flamingo and Crown Rail um, pickup. And uh, the person uh, texted me. I can't remember his name. I think his name was like Jeffrey or something, or Jeff or something. I don't know. Um, they texted me and told me to um, call them when I'm at the pickup. So I called where I got the pickup, and they told me that the rider got redirected to to another ride, and they they basically say you know this is Uber support. So I figure that they were trying to scare me. They, uh, they was like they need to do a vacation. They need to do, do like a two step verification, and then I'm like they wouldn't be calling me from an Uber pickup number if it was Uber support. So I hung up. They called me back t- two more times and I didn't answer. So then they canceled the ride, and I got a cancellation fee. So I'm like, I'm not going to play that game tonight. So anyway, um, if y'all Uber drivers or Lyft drivers get um, a fare, and y'all going to pick up, and they tell you to, like, call them or something, just, you know, I mean, you could call them because it could be scary. Ugh. It could be a legit reason why they're asking you to call them, but if they say something like that they, they need to do a verification or something, um, I'm not saying Uber support won't call you. I mean, I had them call me before because I, 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 I had an incident before and they called me about that, but um, if they're calling from an Uber passenger number or Lyft passenger number, then it's not Uber support. So if if you get a call from like a, a, a passenger number, I, I know like, like, I know usually in uh, Las Vegas, it's usually Las Vegas Air Coast, that's the um, support, you know, like the uh, the pickup uh, passenger number. I know sometimes, you know, it may, it may be like, like a number from like out of state or something, but I know usually uh, the Uber, if, if that kind of Uber support is usually a California number, I usually, I, I believe, I know the uh, Lyft pick- pickup numbers are usually 415 or 760, but, um, but usually if it's people from Uber, it's usually people from foreign countries. I never uh, had anybody call me from Lyft before, but uh, I deal with Uber more, so I know more about Uber. So if you know if, if somebody call you and they and they're like they need to do a ver- a verification uh, process, um, then hang up, um, hang up, and then uh, call call like Uber immediately, or if it's Lyft. I know Lyft, uh, you had to text them, but then you can ask them to call you back. But yeah, uh, don't, don't fall for that, because it, it, it's going to be a scam. They're going to try to get your bank account number or get your debit card number or something, and then, like, um, like get in your account and, like, take, take your money. Don't fall for that, because it almost happened to me, but I was able to figure out what's going on, and I, and I stopped them from doing that to me. So please, uh... Don't don't fall for those tricks. Just hang up and call and call, call Uber support and talk to them and tell them what's going on. I did text Uber support last night. That they didn't respond back, but uh, I probably will call them later and and uh, tell them in, in case they don't respond back. I, I just call and tell them what happened. And Liv, I know Liv. You have to text them and have them call you back, and you just tell them. Yeah, but don't don't fall for that because people are trying to get get money, trying to milk you dry and get money. For, for whatever reason they need to get money for. So just be careful. Don't don't fall for these tricks. And um, always like, share, subscribe. Be careful out there. Just don't fall for these tricks. 
Yeah, but be careful and uh, have a good night. Be safe and and uh, don't fall for these tricks from these uh, passengers trying to scam you. All right, have a good night. Bye.